My name is Sanan Ziyama and uh, I'm from Liberia. I migrated to the United States in 2004. I went to Purdue for my PhD in theoretical physics. My studies were specialized in a branch of uh, physics called string theory. And basically what that means is that we try to understand certain physical theories of particles that make up the universe in the language of string theory. Once I was there at Purdue, then I, I, I became aware of the many opportunities that are available there for international students. Other opportunities were also available in terms of providing some sort of moral support for students in different student groups. I just graduated quite recently, a couple of months ago. I still have a very vivid memory of most of my experiences there. But one important experience that I had there, which I think will last with me forever, is the experience of connecting and interacting with students from diverse backgrounds, you know, and uh, this is an opportunity that comes very rarely and it sometimes occurs based on where you are. I think Purdue was a very ideal place for such a thing to happen. So I was very fortunate to mingle and interact with people from different nations, Europe, Asia, here of course America and Africa as well and different parts of Africa. It created the opportunity to generate lasting friendship with people and some of these friends of course that I was fortunate to have met at Purdue are very important to me now and they are part of my network now and so this makes it very difficult for these sort of memories to go away because these are people who are now my friends and this friendship continues even after some of them have graduated along with me and moved back to their various countries but we still keep in touch because we still have certain we share certain ideas in common and these ideas are powerful in such a way that they keep people connected even when they are located at uh, different geographical locations. In the United States I was fortunate at least to have been in a place where certain qualities were recognized by institutions and uh, I was certainly given some help to improve these qualities and these aspects of myself because they recognized that these things were important aspects of education and they value these kind of qualities. Yeah, certainly very interesting research that has been conducted by Purdue professors in physics, in biology, in engineering. And Purdue is one of the top schools, for example, in engineering and uh, chemistry, particularly analytical chemistry. And it certainly has a very strong physics department. And uh, so there are giant labs at Purdue University that do very top-notch research work. For instance, there is a center called the Berg Nanotechnology Center, which has very advanced and modern equipment. There is a uh, huge uh, collaboration among physics professors who work on setting uh, biophysics experiments and with other professors from uh, biology and from chemistry and for instance cancer research and things like that and uh, they have sophisticated equipment and I've talked to students from these groups because uh, some of them are in physics and they work in collaboration with students from other sciences but they are certainly very happy and they think what they are doing are very important sort of work and they go to conferences and they give talks that are very welcome in the scientific community and it's because of the kind of equipment they are using and the talents they have. So certainly Purdue does have very good opportunity in terms of providing all of the things you need in a lab. When I was studying at Purdue, I was probably one of two or three students from Liberia on the entire Purdue campus. This kind of statistic can be frightening for some students from minority backgrounds but I don't think they should have that kind of concern because it wasn't a problem for me I had a lot of support there is also organizations that help minority students and one of the most important organizations that I participated in was the AGAP Alliance program so this is a graduate alliance program that provides some network 
of minority students in the STEM disciplines in graduate school at Purdue University. It's a very good organization because sometimes they provide you some extra funding for research just in case maybe you ran out of funding in your lab. The AGAP community provides some extra funding for minority students but most importantly they provide a community for minority students to meet and talk about what is stressing them out, for instance, in their lives. And it's, it's really wonderful to have a support network. I think a student from Liberia should recognize that being at Purdue is once in a lifetime opportunity. If you are accepted at a top university like Purdue, you want to create, you want to leave a legacy that other people behind you will benefit from. I would, I would certainly recommend Purdue University. In fact, I've also been involved in projects that, that attempt to create a certain platform that gives students from Liberia the opportunity to come to Purdue and also to spread the news about Purdue in Liberia. So yes, I, I think for, for a student to leave from Liberia and come to Purdue, it's an opportunity for Purdue, but it's certainly a better opportunity for a Liberian student to come to an institution that has very good professors who are top ranked and well recognized in their fields of studies. So that would be a, a definite that would definitely be a game changer for students who would leave from Liberia to come to Purdue.